Hi everyone, it's Kathleen. I've been away for several days at Sylvan Lake and today I'm back because I received this in the mail while I was gone. It looks like it's from Daphne's Diary. So let's look inside. I cut some of the craft paper tape off and I couldn't get the box open, so I'm glad I was able to stick my hand in. Open this up, and let's have a look inside. Yep, oops, is that anything? What's this thing? Yes, I'm hoping to cut this apart and use this cardboard for something because it's a good, solid cardboard. And I am getting this directly from Daphne's Diary in the Netherlands. In the past, when I have paid for... Um, for magazines and or anything else I purchased. Yes, shipping is expensive to Canada. I don't know about any other place. I pay just as much in shipping as I do for the products. And I love what I get. I'm very glad to purchase it online when I purchase it. And this is from Daphne. She sends this beautiful card. And let's see what we have. So this is my 2023 Daphne's Diary. I don't know if you want to call it a planner or a day timer. I use this all the time and I love it so much. I don't ever want to be without this kind of a planner. I haven't been making it fancy and it, it's on my, it's in my bedroom all the time, and I always refer to it. I can't remember dates, things I have, appointments, functions. I have to write it down. If it's not in my diary, my planner, my whatever you want to call it, I will not remember. So let's see what we have here today. It looks like we have a number six. 2023 Daphne's Diary Magazines. I have a whole stack, a whole thick stack of Daphne's Diary Magazines. I have yet, this year I think, to make a mat home. If I did make one, maybe I did. I can't remember. I'm going to flip through this. These are some extra pieces that we got in here. Maybe it's inside. You get things and stuff as well. So I got this. I got, what is this? Oh, she, she does beautiful artwork and Les, Les Papillon Blues, Blue Butterfly. Gorgeous. I wish one day Daphne's Diary would allow people to sell their products that they create, like journals from their Daphne's Diary products. We can use other magazines and other books, but there's a clause on their website that Daphne does not want us to use this in anything we make for sale. So it can only be a gift or for ourselves. I'm praying to God one day that may change. But in the meantime, I create journals for myself and I say I'm going to do it online. And so this is the Daphne's Diary magazine. This is, this looks like their 2024 planner. I will go through this. And I also want to show you in upcoming videos how to make, how to make journals with these used diaries. So this is an older diary. This is from 2021, and this is a brand new one. This one I will be using as my diary day timer, and what should we start with? Let's start with this day timer, because I'm just fascinated with their day timers. Their day timers are fantastic, fantastic. Yes, you can get other ones. Yes, you can get cheaper ones. 
but I love mine to death. I will always purchase one online directly from Daphne's Diary. I live in Canada. Sometimes chapters or Indigo or whatever their store slash name is carries them in stock, but they're never current because chapters relies on other distributors to receive their products from. So if, if you order yours directly from Daphne's Diary in the Netherlands and pay for the shipping, you'll get them very fast. I even in I I think mine have come even in two weeks. I was shocked by how fast mine got here. But if you don't want to pay the exorbitant amount of shipping, then well, you're gonna to have to wait for whichever store carries them. And again, I live in Canada, so I have to rely on chapters if and when they get them. So these envelopes are awesome it's a vellum envelope heavy vellum envelope and inside you get stickers and which one is this this is the new one new one for this year and this is probably a stencil a stencil to draw things on your planner with so there are lots of ways to decorate your planner if you want to have it all decorated so i'm planning to decorate a month in advance each each month and I can show you how I do that on camera so this is a page I would save this for a page in a book it's a in journals because I make journals scrappy journals this is a very beautiful happy birthday postcard but I again would use it as a page so I would like to show you in the other diaries the old used well diaries day timers I'm not sure if that's an actual diary or a planner we'll have a look at it right away bookmark beautiful tag oh my gosh this is awesome so this comes with the new planner all this stuff comes in and in the envelope and I'm going to leave it right now in the envelope and we will come back and create the month of ja January I'll show you. So these, I just want to flip through the pages because they're so beautiful. Let's go down a little closer. Okay. The artwork here is just stunning. Absolutely stunning. So these are the current year, which in this case would be 2024. And you also have the next year. She also have just different things. If you want to record how many steps you do, what you have for a meal, what shows are on TV, and your mood. So she has a lot of things to do every month in here. It looks like she has a bucket list here. She always has, you'll see, okay, these are contacts. The artwork is just stunning. So these are days of the, not days, these are, months of the year oh, it looks like she has this cut out maybe this could be a, a bookmark so look at this look at her illustrations they're absolutely stunning january these would make beautiful pages or covers for journals when we're finished and look at this another cut out page here it shows that you're supposed to cut that out and maybe use it as a bookmark January so I will be coming back on camera and it, it, to show you how I would maybe decorate this this one month in January and it between every this is a from Monday through Sunday and I like that I can write stuff and I use maybe times in crossing over when I have when I have to go somewhere and dates but there's also things to buy, things to do, and some writing pad. I tend to remove these and save these for what I would like journals in the future. So every single in between has one of these in it, and it's different illustrations. Just gorgeous. So there's such beautiful things 
that you can make with these extra planner pages. And I'm going to show you how to make tall, narrow journals. And by tall and narrow, I mean one of these size, like it's gonna be small, narrow, and tall. My journals are gonna be tall and narrow when I make them. So that's the month of January. We have February. Look at this gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous image. Oh, beautiful. Oh, it looks like she's getting on the stitching bandwagon because lots of people are, are uh, stitching nowadays, which is a nice revival. And again, look, you have a beautiful image. And look at how nice this makes for, for writing in a book, for writing in a journal. Absolutely gorgeous imagery. Daphne's planners are my absolute ultimate number one favorites and yes when I buy them I pay shipping to Canada which in my case if this planner is $35 yes I pay $35 for shipping so 70 bucks later plus for me I have GST plus the duty fees plus this plus that but I wouldn't be without this I don't buy luxury items often and for me this is a necessity I just love it so much I've tried different um, different journals from, I say journals, it's the wrong word, different planners from Staples. I'm just not happy with them. That's my personal opinion, and I would rather pay to have something. It's eye candy. I look at it every single day, and it just makes me happy. And you see how this all coordinates? Just gorgeous. So all of these can be torn out and made into pages for journals and we will I will be showing that on camera March just gorgeous imagery so I'm gonna fat oh wow that is just so beautiful I love how things extend onto the other page to the to a page just continue to flow over top and look at this just gorgeous absolutely gorgeous I I love her planners. I can't speak enough. Just look at how beautiful this is. I can't express enough how beautiful I think her planners are. Just love it. The imagery is gorgeous. Whoops, what fell on me? Yeah, these box. Absolutely gorgeous. You see how it just carries, and it, the, the every page is different. Just amazing, and look how it goes together. Just amazing. I just can't believe how beautiful that is. Me. Wow, these are so nice. When you flip this over, so this is meant to be cut. I want to fold on this line. I want to see where it goes to. Okay, right up to the month. And look at how nice that little page is. So that's going to make a beautiful page in a book in the future. Oh, look, Penelope. Look at the kitty cats. Oh my gosh, they're adorable. Oh my goodness. How gorgeous is that? I just love how that flows. It's like a double page layout. It's just gorgeous. And these are single sheets in between. Absolutely gorgeous. Pure eye candy. Art makes me smile. Just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Junes. So you see how every page is different? Oh, that's pretty. Every page is different. And yet they all flow and blend together. If you get a chance and are able to, I would highly advise ordering one of these planners. If you if you use planners, I use them every single day. My memory is is very very bad, very bad. 
people ask me to do things, I says, I, I can't commit. I have to wait till I get home where, I, cause I, I've tried carrying this with me, but I don't want to lose it. That would be awful. So I want to, I leave it at home in my bedroom. Look at how gorgeous that is. And so if people want to ask me to something or ask if I can do something, they have, I, they my daughters know, are you by your calendar, mom? Are you by your planner? And I says, no, I'm not. Okay. They'll, they'll ask if I can do something. I'll say yes, but I'm not committing 100% until I get to my planner. No memory. My recent memory is not there. Look at this. Uh, September. Absolutely gorgeous. Did you see how every one of those had a stitching page? That could be a separate journal in itself with 12 of these pages in there. Gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Every, every week is different. And just look at how that, that flows. It's so beautiful. Just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Look at lovely oh and then in here so you get this is a perforated po uh, postcards which I would take out and I would use these as individual pages in a journal and look at how gorgeous that is so every month we could make a journal out of this existing planner and I'm going to show you how I create journals with these day timers. How sweet is that? Just look at that. Art in itself. I like how it carries over. I just think her artistic ability is amazing. It's beautiful. Dried hydrangeas, month of October. When you carry things over, your eye flows onto the next page. Beautiful, just beautiful. November, da -da -da. a stitch book is, has got to be in using these pages. Tall, narrow journal using that. I love this. So we're going to see how we're going to do that. Attach it. Have to use those. Gorgeous. We are into November. Just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous. It just flows. Your eye flows from one page to the next. And no two designs are are the same. Yes, the layout is there. The month is there. The, the days, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday is always there. Yes, it's always rectangles, but the drawings and the colors are different. Things to buy, things to do, always there. And always a black, sorry, a blank, um, I don't know what to call these dotted squares. It's like graph paper, but with dots. There must be a name for that that I don't know. Gorgeous. Highly recommend these. This is my absolute favorite. Favorite, favorite. Can't say that enough. Just gorgeous. So we're into December now. Just gorgeous. Carrying things across the page that are similar. Makes it all unified. December and January, so we must be coming to the end. Okay, and this is a sticker page. 
or we can just peel the stickers off and use them. Note page. Gorgeous. In the envelope. Okay, they're giving us these things in this envelope. So you get another, another envelope in the back. Love these pockets. Look at how beautiful that is. So in the pocket here, we get all these things. We get washi tape. We get a ruler, a book, uh, tag, tab. Okay, so these are tabs. Months of the year and just different stickers in here. So I'm not going to take that apart. So you get all that in there. And... This beautiful, I love this thing. This is so gorgeous. So this is the, oh, look at the back. Okay, website, www.daphnesdiary.com. That's where you can get these online. Okay, and they also gave me this diary. It's an old diary. An old diary that I want to make journals from. And I'm just walking, walking, walking. What do I have here? I just don't know if I have any pages done up that might have some stuff in it. Where did I put all my stuff? Oh, right here. There's some stuff. Whoa. Okay. So this is a page in an old diary. And look, I used an old book. And look at how nice this is to start off with. I just covered up the words that I might have written down and used. This is my 200-year-old book page at, that I glued onto it. And I only put glue where my words were where I wrote. And then I put a book page on and then I tore off the part that didn't stick. I'll show you how to do that. But look at how nice that is. Ready to go. Ready to go. So these pages, I can't just stick in any journals that I make. Again, remember that you are not allowed to sell any journals made from Daphne's Diary products. That's just one of their policies. Don't ask me why. Ask Daphne that. Write her website. Okay. So... We can make journals. So this is just some of the pages I've started. And this is an old diary. This is a 2021 diary. I'm not going to leaf through every page because it's an older diary. It's an, it's an unused one that Daphne's diary sent me so I can show you how to make journals with these old planners. Okay, so watch for videos coming up on that. And now we have the journal. I said a wrong thing. We have the, oh my, how come my computer's on? Bizarre. Okay, Daphne's Diary number six. And these are the style of books, junk, junk journals that I have made in the past using Daphne's Diaries magazines. I make one for myself and I've made one for Lisa. So this must be a Christmas one because I see um, Christmas things and stuff. So we will be making journals like this online. I run into difficulty. I don't do too much of the Daphne's Diary because I can't sell them and I just show you how to do them on my channel and my, my measly... $5, $500 a month just doesn't cover, cover expenses. So that's why I try to sell my journals to increase my income. So let's go up. Okay. Daphne's Diary, number six, 2023. Her images are absolutely gorgeous. There we go. Hopefully I'm in the middle. Wow. Just gorgeous. Okay, very, very nice. Look at this. Oh my. I use all of her, in, not all of her, everything in her journal, but I use a lot of her handmade or hand-drawn, got her hand drawings in the journals. 
To create a whole journal from, from scratch, it takes a long time. So it depends on how many hours a person wants to record videos, every single page, just a certain number of pages or what have you. So I will be doing a regular junk journal as well as a tall, narrow journals out of the planners, as well as decorating my planner for the month of January. I will do that on camera. Look at this beautiful blue and white. Absolutely gorgeous. So there's a lot of things I use in the Daphne's Diary magazines when I create my journals. I like using her artwork. I maybe fussy cut some of the images and I will show you exactly how I do that. Look at this. You can make a, I don't know if that's a door hanger. It's quite large and it, it'll tell us in here once we read it what this is. So that's printed paper. You can also make a kitty cat one and it's printed on the back. And I read her book, I read her magazine and then I tear tear it up and do some fussy cutting. I love all the little things that we can use in our journals and I'll show you how to do that. Oh my, Daphne's Dire diary advent calendar i seen that because i subscribed to her emails and it looks like you can purchase this online yes order yours at www.daphnesdiary.com they have so many products that you can order so many things you can make and it's really really fun to do these things Gosh, the articles are gorgeous. I like cutting out the little things with the tapes and tearing that out. I like how that page is turned down. Ten differences. What is this? And this is, these are stickers that you can use. Oh, you can make little flags for your hamburgers. Oh, gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Where do people get their money from? It just blows my mind. All right. Things I would have done differently in my lifetime. I would have saved a lot more. I made good money and I spent good money. Bad, bad me. Lesson learned, but I can't go back and repeat. Look at this. Gorgeous. All these papers would look very nice. In journals. Where did I see Canada? For the U.S. and Canada... Okay, www.expressmag.com. That's a a website that ships magazines. From what I gather, it still takes, it's it's not within weeks of um, release from the Netherlands. Because by the time that magazine gets there, by the time they do their bit and then send it off to their bit, there's a, there is a backlog from what I gather on, from people's, comments to me so that's why I say I ordered directly from Daphne's diary what is this a memory game okay so we learn how to do a memory game oh stuffed kitty cats kitty cat dolls oh my gosh that's a whole art form in itself love using sheet music love using these tags her imagery is just gorgeous. When I make a Daphne's Diary journal, it is so different. It's still scrappy, but it's... Because I usually do vintage vintage journals. So I, I do two different kinds. I do Daphne's style scrappy journals, and I do my vintage style scrappy journals. See, the fonts are gorgeous. I love to use the fonts. Oh, tells us about our 2024 planner. A little bit inside. Some of the things you get with it. Very nice. A page of artwork. Tells us what we can do with it. Different drawings. I've done this. You can order this on their website. Oh, maybe these are the, some of the things you can order. Plantable card, carrier bag, ceramic mugs, notebooks, flower embroidery kit. This was fun to do. 
new journal uh, day timers a4 paper and envelopes that's nice for people who write letters or just to get to there's our beloved queen what's this i'll have to read clay maybe not sure Wow, look at the artwork there. Holy Hannah. Gorgeous. Have to carpet of flowers. Wow. I'll have to read where that is. Sunflower oil. The uses. Van Gogh sunflowers. Oh, what's this? This is usually a, a recipe. Recipe little page for you to make. Oh, and some fairies. Look at this. Oh, elves. She says elves. Elves, fairies. I'll have to read and see what she does with them. Beautiful flowers to fussy cut. So these magazines are wonderful. I love them. Our book is a gift you can open again and again. It's true. It is. Look at this. Coloring sheet. Look at that. I love this. I like putting different things and stuff. Now, is that embroidery? An original postcard, and she embroidered on it. That's nice. Embroidered on running shoes, embroidered pillows. Look at that. Nice, nice. This is interesting paper. Sometimes she has different feeling paper. Bows. So we can make bows and put them on. Parcels. Look at that. Oops, I wonder if that's, it just feels like two. I would use this as paper, as a page, because it's so beautiful. But it does show you how to make the bows. But I love this. I just love that. Look at that. It's just gorgeous. And then this is another one. Beautiful. So what do we have here? Is that that poster? So yes, it is. It's the second poster. I, I was given... Oh, I don't know if it's the same or not. Mine said Blue Papillon. This is a little different. Gorgeous artwork in here. Beautiful artwork. Butterflies. So you can hang it up and frame it. Or you can tear it apart. Lavender... Beautiful. Look at those peacocks. Gorgeous. Souvenirs. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. Flowers on a stick. That would be nice to just trim off and use in your book. How nice. In your journal. Oh my lord. Look at that. Love this paper. Love the flowers and love the paper. Gosh, how extraordinary is that? Wow. Okay, what's on the back of this page? Pretty. Wow. Just wow. Book tips. And is that the back of Daphne's story? The back of Daphne's story. Very, very nice. Okay, so that's the video for today. Daphne's Diary number six, the 2024 planner. And this is an old planner, 2021, that I would like to make long, narrow journals with. And I will show you how to do that on camera. So that's everything for today. And we will see you, see you soon. Bye for now.